Enrollment for next school year is already underway. And whether you choose public or private, you have a lot of options to consider when deciding what's best for your children's education. More options than ever, and one of them, magnet schools, each with a particular focus. <laughs> There's a Hamilton County Magnet School Fair happening for the next hour or so, and Channel 3's Tim Pham has more. Hamilton County has 15 magnet schools. They are still a part of the public school system, but they offer special instruction and programs not available anywhere else. This family from Ottawa is up early and near the front of the drop-off line at Battle Academy. With me working downtown, it's really easier for me to get off of work and come here and pick her up. Choosing a school is an important decision for families. When the time came for Natalie Carter to pick a school for her daughter, she looked into magnet schools. The reason why I chose the magnet school over public school is because it's more hands-on in regard to the teachers and the parents. Each magnet has a unique personality, as some might say. Oh, they have different themes and instructional approaches. At Battle Academy, they focus on the theory of multiple intelligences developed in 1983 by Dr. Howard Gardner. We try to plan instruction throughout our day that hits the body smarts, uh, logic smart, music smart, all the different smarts, and we have a strong arts integration. Class sizes range from 18 to 21 students per class and are often more diverse because students from anywhere in the county can apply to attend. I like the diversity here. Um, everyone is treated equal. Um, everyone is basically valued for what they bring to the table. Parents can't get out of homework either. Each family has to complete 18 hours of service to the school each year. We have dads come in and build um, the bench that's outside was built. Moms come in and uh, help students in various activities throughout the day. The process to get in can be competitive. Last year, 150 students applied for 40 spots at Battle Academy. Sometimes parents like magnet schools based on location, but more often than not, I think it's our instructional practices that are the big draw. This year, the system is moving to an electronic lottery system. Carter says, do your research and narrow your search down before applying. Take a look at the school. You're able to tour the school. Um, they offer tours, so it's always fun just to look at, you know, what your um, child is interested in. Applications for magnet schools are due on Thursday, January 31st. You can find the application inside the WRCB app. In the studio, I'm Tim Pham, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Tim. Well,